Hey, Shedders, it's BOC live in the Artist Lounge watershed, day two, and straight off the stage. After an amazing performance in his rookie year, in your rookie year at Watershed, welcome my buddy Warren Ziders. Welcome to the Artist Lounge, and welcome to Watershed. It is beautiful out here. It is beautiful out here. The amenities y'all got, oh, it's, it's amazing. And the crowd, too. Awesome. So when you woke up this morning and you looked around, I'm, I'm assuming, and I'm pretty sure I'm right, that this is your first time here. First time here. What went through your head? So I woke up originally on the bus, and I'm like, why am I up this early? <laughs> Number one, realized we were at a gas station, thought we were here already, but we weren't. Then I wake up here, and Jared's like, my, my tour manager's like, you got to get up, man. You got to go see how cool this place is. And I'm like, I need my coffee. Let me wake up first. Walked out here. Absolutely stunning. This is There's like no better place to play. So when you see an environment, and what, the, what we try to get across to the fans is, you know, the artist experience is not the same every day. No. You know, you, you show up at, at a gig, and you're half the time you're like, hello, Cleveland. I don't know where I am. I know I'm in the Pacific Northwest somewhere, right? I'm somewhere. And you thought the gas station was the gig, right? And sometimes <laughs> it is. Um, but do, does it, when you walk out and you see something like this, it changes your day. It truly does. I was joking with my band. I got up here and like I was staring out into the abyss and I was kind of like looking. I'm like, I feel like a computer trying to render something. I'm like, my brain's trying to compute what I'm looking at, but it, it does. I think today, honestly, gratitude, blessing, and kind of makes you give you a realization of I get to do this for a living. I don't have to. I get to do this. And it's, it's just absolutely blessing. And let's talk about the show. So I went out to front of house and because last time, a couple weeks ago, we were together. I watched from the side and you can't really hear. Uh, for FYI, guys, you don't want to be on the stage. You can't hear anything. So I went out to front of house and I watched it and it, it, it reaffirmed what I, you and I talked about two weeks ago, which is not only is there a lot happening on that stage, but the interaction with the fans is rabid. How how do you measure that in your head? Just it's straight adrenaline, man. I think that like I last night I played a show and then I come here and I get off and then it's like your body's almost shaking because of how much that crowd just feeds. And the big thing about me, man, when it comes to these shows, the more you feed me, the more I'm gonna give it back. And it's just like this transfer of energy, but Honestly, I didn't know what to expect. Just like you said, you play the gas station, whatever it is, every crowd's different, and you don't know. It's my rookie year. You're like, you know, are they going to know me? Are they going to know the songs? I got out there, and I was absolutely amazed. Absolutely amazed. The Shedders are known for their enthusiasm, and you know, as you, as you kick off your own tour here in the fall, I hope you remember the fans here at Watershed, and, and I hope that, they're, that their enthusiasm follows you all the way across the country. Amen. This is BOC Live in the Artist Lounge. Warren Ziders has been my guest. We'll be back with you in just a little while.